Uh, morning team, Peter Moody here at Pakenham on uh, Tuesday morning the 1st of September, first day of spring, happy spring. Here's Platinum Invader with leading Australian jumps jockey, formerly from New Zealand, Tony I. Harker. Hello, Tone. Hey, mate. And your phone's ringing. Shouldn't have the phone on when you're grazing such a great horse. No. Uh, listen, <laughs> serious note, he had a good, strong gallop, went pace work about a mile and a half, quickened home uh, from the 1200 and improved home a nice 600 this morning with uh, Luke Nolan in the saddle. Uh, worked good and solid. The ground was a bit sticky, which we know he doesn't like, so... Uh, um, but pleased with him, good in the action, good in the wind. So we're going to look to maybe kick him off at Mooney Valley this Saturday in a mile handicap. He'll get 62 kilos, but as we know, that's a long way short of his best. And uh, I'm just going to get him to treat it as a trial and get a run into him, so then I can start looking at mile and a quarter options for him. If the ground is wet, I won't hesitate to wait for uh, Flemington the following week because I'm not going to kick him off on wet ground. So uh, happy, healthy horse in good shape and work solid this morning has really come on. That's Platinum Invader. You happy with him, Tony? Pretty much. Uh, anything you want to say anything to the family back home? You... Hi, Mum. Hi, Mum. Yeah. Right, uh, good lad. <laughs> <laughs> Platinum Invader having a bit of a jump. Along with his stable mate, best ever. Break it up, break the monotony of going around the track. They just go out and have a light trot and canter and do something a bit different. Hang a few. Let them invade it. here at Pakenham uh, Wednesday morning. He's just competed in a thousand metre gallop. Unfortunately we got decent rain overnight and the track is uh, well into the slope, soft range. Uh, prior to that it was okay but uh, he's just had a nice gallop. Very happy with that team. Listen, uh, as Jeff said, a bit more rain than we wanted but he's had a nice gallop, action good, having a good blow and we'll assess him off the back of that. What do you think Luke? Yep, um, he covered up right but yeah, that stain, stain prowess he's got sort of kicked in late, they're a bit sharp with the knees at this stage of his career, so at uh, this stage of his prep. Um, probably would have wanted it at the top of the ground, but that's fine. He's had to go up. Um, he's taken nice, he's had a nice blow, so he's going to take nice improvement. And nice going around the barriers, did everything right around there? Yeah, yeah, good attitude, so. Um, Press on? Yes. Thanks, mate. And we'll follow up with more probably after a gallop next week. Platinum Invader, Jason Benbow, just worked over 1,200 and proved home 400 on the all-weather, Jase. That looked nice work. Yeah, it was really good work. I was quite pleased with the way they finished the work off. Yep. Um, pulled up, had a nice little blow, but he recovered quite quickly. Yep. He's quite really bright within himself, so I'm very happy with him. No, happy days, mate. Uh, he's really done well since his trial last week. This boy, very happy with his condition, so... Uh, upwards and onwards and there's a couple of options coming up in the next couple of weeks there's a mile handicap at Mooney Valley and a 1700 handicap at Flemington the week later so probably look at one of those to kick him off in but uh, pleased with where he's at he's really done well since that jump out last week Platinum Invader we'll keep you updated as long as that one doesn't get in his way there off he goes home Coming out of the pool, pulled up well from his gallop this morning, had a laps of the pool. Looks in good order. Hey mate, happy and healthy. Seems in good shape, seems to be enjoying life. Not sure about the swimming pool on a cool afternoon, but he goes home, gets a woolen rug on, and goes on the walking machine for 20 minutes.